Hello fam, this is Sanjay Rai. Again, here with the Rai Rocking Information for all of you. So today we have a student from Hochschule München. Uh, she is going to tell you about her course, what she studies there, and what type of, uh, and also about the course information. So, so hi Sharanya, how are you? I'm good, how are you? I'm also good. So, Sh <laughs> so Sharanya, tell the viewers what course you are studying at Hochschule München, yeah. and also about the course information. Yeah, I'm studying micro and nanotechnology in Hochschule München. Like it's been like two two years. I'm here in Germany. I've finished my bachelor's in mechatronics mm -hmm. in India, mm -hmm. and it's basically the it has seventy percent of mechanical and twenty five percent of electrical. Mm -hmm. So micro nanotechnology, which has all kinds, all different fields, mm -hmm. like from mechanical, electrical, and uh, materials, chemical, biology, all the things combined okay. and into the micro nanotechnology. So that's a pretty interesting course. Yeah, if anyone can join, like even yeah. you, if you've done your bachelor's in chemical, then you have you can come to micro nanotechnology if you are interested. Mm -hmm. And that's that's pretty cool to get into semiconductor physics. Okay. okay. And also give like a, a, just a short introduction of yours. What was your background and how you ended up coming here in this university? Uh, yeah. Uh, the, uh, for the first time, um, like um, I started micro and nanotechnology because I was pretty uh, passionate about uh, semiconductor physics, okay. which has co uh, quantum physics in it. Mm -hmm. Which is, which is very interesting for us because uh, Einstein has found the relativity, the theory of relativity from it. So, and it has micro nanostructures. It, the, the core structure is like, which has so much of research and development, which is uh, around running around like so many companies in BMW, uh, Airbus, and in so many uh, some like. I think in every company, every company, okay. yeah, <laughs> in every company you need micro nanotechnology because. Uh, you can see if your phone or any phone or any uh, laptop or any any system you can see there are semiconductor physics chips mm -hmm. which are very pretty much uh, developed by micro nanotechnology mm -hmm. like it has lithography all the stuff yeah so you are living in munich so yeah. are you living right now in student and work or you are just uh, living in another private accommodation uh, no right now i got my uh, uh, my own apartment like my in own this dorm. semester not in this semester, it's been like one one year now. Okay. Uh, for this April, I finished my one year. So you, so you got the uh, student and work uh, yeah. after one year? Yeah, after one year. Okay. After coming to uh, Germany, then I lived in so many accommodations for two months, for three months. And that and was quite expensive too. Yeah, that is quite expensive because we are in England, in England okay. right? So it is quite an expensive city. So it's been, for me, it was pretty good I think so because I found some uh, family friends uh, while uh, they took me from the airport and they I I can stay for a few months with them then after find after that if I find some good accommodation then I have shifted to other apartment my own apartment which is very expensive okay. that too <laughs> then after some like after one year then I got my own accommodation oh. after waiting for one year. Yeah. For me, it's was like I just got the keys when I landed. Ah, that's pretty cool. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> that is pretty cool. You didn't find any. No, no, I didn't face any yeah. because I had my friends there and they, yeah. they like they try to book it yeah. just before. Yeah. So I also made a uh, interesting video on mm -hmm. that. You can have a look at it. Okay. So what about the share? Tell them about any German level. Like, did you learn any German? Yeah, I or learned. Are you, uh, yeah. still I... in work? <laughs> I, I have to still be in the work because I learned up to A2 in the India itself and after coming over here I started doing from A2 I have continued my A2 level and till now I have done my B1 that's okay-ish like okay-ish for the German skills but not pretty good okay yeah uh, what about this, like the course you are studying, micro and nanotechnology, which is a master's? Yeah. What do you suggest to the students who are planning to come? Like, if they yeah. want to take this course, mm -hmm. why they should take this course? Like, what type of interest they should have? So that if you have so much interest in physics, mm -hmm. basically you have to so much knowledge in physics or something interest which you find interesting in doing maths, or if you find interesting in doing physics, then it's pretty good for you. And if you want to go into into research and development field, then it's pretty good good for you for doing so much interesting topics like because I am doing my master's right now it's been like one month <laughs> okay. now. yeah 
So I am doing my master's thesis in uh, military uh, institute of materials, which is pretty good, I think. So <laughs> yeah, yeah, it's from German, uh, German military based. So it's I am working on a new material which they don't uh, till now they don't, uh, didn't have any knowledge about it. Okay. The people don't have any knowledge about it. <laughs> so that is pretty good, right? You are inventing something. Yeah, you are yeah. inventing something. Yes. <laughs> yeah, that's pretty good. Yeah, that, that's cool. And what about the job opportunities? Like, what you are specifically planning after completing your master's thesis? Yeah. Are you? Like, yeah. I just, yeah, I just want to do my PhD over here. Mm -hmm. It's like very good for your uh, future, and you will get so much of respect from the people from the society if you do a PhD over here. Yeah, yeah, sure. That is pretty cool. I mean, pretty interesting in the German people. Yes. Like they want to do at least like if they will finish the bachelor's or master's, and they will start doing for one or one or two years of the job. And they'll start. They are applied for the PhD. It's compulsory for them. They have to pursue some okay. good, good, yeah, good education, so that they'll, they'll have some lev uh, good level of uh, salary or good level of um, position. That is pretty good for them. Like they keep on studying. <laughs> okay. keep on study, stuff. Never ending study. Yeah, <laughs> they keep on doing the research on so many materials and so much stuff. Like they keep on studying. So students who wants to come in this course, <laughs> be prepared because it, there's a lot to study in it. Yeah, like, if you want to do some interesting, interesting stuff, things, so there's a yeah. lot of things. Yeah. So that was all. Like you, you came to know about all the things what you wanted to know about micro, nanotechnology, masters, or even bachelor's people who want to you yeah. do this course. That's all the things which he discussed. And I hope this information was uh, like useful to you. So stay tuned for my next videos. Till then, be safe and stay at home. Bye. Bye.